Hey guys, welcome to... Whoa. What? Why is my camera off? Well, uh, that's okay, because we're actually going to look at how to save a project in Visual C Sharp 2010 Express. Um, it's a little confusing at first. I was trying to find a way to save project. Well, it doesn't really let you save a project. Um, but it will, let's see, uh, it will let you save a solution, which is basically the same thing. So let me see if I can't, um, let me edit this, let me just like delete this and then retype it. So it'll make me actually, um, it'll put a little star in the corner here, meaning that it has not been saved. Because what I want to do is make sure that um, it prompts me to save it as it would someone making a new file. So we're going to go to file, and then normally you'd go like save program CSS, but we want to since I'm going to be expanding on this and making multiple files in the same project, um, we're going to actually want to just hit close solution and then it will prompt you to either uh, save changes to the following items, um, which I have done, or it will say, do you want to save the solution? And then it'll pop up with this um, thing. Let me actually... Uh, make a new solution so that you can see that maybe let's see okay so I just made this new uh, console application one uh, just a new solution instead of the other one and what we're going to do is hit close solution and it'll look like this do you want to save or discard changes to the current solution so you'll hit save and then it will pop up with this little box here that says name location solution name etc and then what you'll do is name it whatever you want, put it wherever you want, and then hit save. But I'm not going to save it because I don't want to save this one. So let me go ahead and close out of the solution and just discard it. And now once it's saved, you're going to want to go to File, Open Project. Or you might be able to actually hit the uh, folder there and open. But I found my car cl uh, class inheritance example. I'm going to click on that. And then you should just be able to open up this one right here. It's called a, um, uh, it doesn't show you here, but let me expand this little thing here. It's called a Microsoft Visual Studio Solution. And if you have your um, Solution Explorer open like this, all to open this, you go to View, Other Windows, Solution Explorer or Control W, comma S. I think that means Control W or Control S. No, because Control S is save. Huh? What what would that actually do? Let's see. Control W. S. Oh, so you have to hit Control W and then while you're also holding Control, hit Control S again. That's kind of strange. Um, you have to hit them in order. So you hit Control W, and then while you're still holding down Control, let go of the W and hit the S instead. Um, and then what you're going to do is open this one, or whatever you named it. I, it just happened to be Program CS for me. Um, I actually want to rename that. But, and here it is. Here's my project from before. Um, that's going to be it for this tutorial. And the next one, I'm actually going to expand on this, make a new file, and um, probably rename this program here. But uh, until then, I'll see you guys later.